Jan Silk. I teach uh, second and third grade at the Carpentry of Family School. How specifically does it work with you and your students? This week, my main goal was just to connect with everyone and get everyone comfortable with Zoom, parents and students. And it took a little while for kids to get in, but eventually I had 20 out of my 23 students online, all in the little grids. You know, I could see all their faces. We were online in our morning meeting for an hour and a half. And the kids were so respectful and patient and sweet. And by the end, an hour and a half down the road, everyone had an animal on their lap or an animal up in front that they were showing us. It was super sweet. And it just felt really, really good to connect. And you could tell, again, that they were longing for that social connect connection with each other. So they all go into our Google Classroom, and it's customized for our class, for Room 34. We now call it Zoom Room 34. Uh, and they go in and there's under materials, they can find a schedule, a daily schedule, and it tells what time they need to be up and gathering their supplies and getting their desk ready with their parents. And then class begins um, at 8.30. So everyone comes on board at 8.30. We'll have our morning meeting again. And then we'll start math during our regular math period. So we'll have math from 9 to 10.15. Then they have, an hour, have a half hour break and then we'll go into language arts. Do you think it's going to be more work for you, less work, or about the same? Oh my gosh, right now it's a lot more. The learning curve is really high. For someone who's been teaching for a long time, I feel like I'm learning all over again. Do you know if there are enough computers for all the students to have at home in our school district? They have computers that have been supplied by the school. Our first writing prompt this week has been, I asked the kids to write me a personal narrative of how it's gone. And I just, I got the cutest responses. I'm um, saying the best part of this is spending time with my pets. I like the feeling of being home. I get to play chess with my brother. So there's all these wonderful things that are happening because of this. Here it says, I hang out with my family. My family's having more dinners together. Another student said, homeschool is exciting for me because I get to spend the day in my pajamas. <laughs> um, here I like staying home and having lunch with my family every day. So you can tell that families are working it out. They're as we teachers are taking attendance throughout the day and throughout the week, if we notice there's someone who's not showing up online or not showing up to our morning meetings, um, we're red flagging our principals and so that the schools know and that's our counselor's jobs. They'll find access the families and make sure that they're okay and that they have everything they need. And How about yes. it? in your own home and you personally. I, you know, my husband and I are going from empty nesters to a house full. Our kids are all home. So we have an adult, a house of adults. It's like a little conference center. Everybody's doing their work in every corner and <laughs> we're working it out. And I, you know, I gotta say that's a benefit for us to have everyone home uh, and their significant others. So it's been pretty special. Stay healthy and Thank I can talk with you. Thanks, Larry. All right, goodbye. All, all the right. best, you stay too. healthy.